In this tutorial, we'll discuss how to add a card in the ProWatch system. A card is added to a badge holder to allow them access through the readers. In Advanced Badging, click on the General Fields button. This will show you a list of your badge holders. Maybe you can search for the specific badge holder. In this case, we're going to use one Honeywell. Click on that user, then go over and click on the Cards tab. As you can see, there are no cards currently assigned to this user. We're going to go up and click Edit to edit the badge holder. And now we're going to click on the New Card button. This will bring up a page here. On this first entry, you will enter in the card number. If there is a PIN code, you will go ahead and enter in the PIN code. The issue date is the day that the card was created and issued. You can change this to the future if you wish. And the expired date is a default expiration date for this card. Again, this can be changed if you wish. For the company, please select the company that contains the clearance codes for this user. In this case, it is an employee. We're going to click Employee. As you can see, it automatically pulled the employee clearance code from the available clearance code list for you. For the card type, choose the appropriate type of card. In this case, it's a standard employee. And for the card status, we're going to set it as active. Now we'll go down here to the bottom and we're going to click Add Card. This now added the card to the badge holder. As you can see, here's your information over here on the right that we completed. Down here, it shows you the card number in green, showing that it is active. If you expand this, it will show you any clearance codes that are assigned to the card. The same as if you go up here to the top, expand the card, it will show you clearance codes. If you wish to, you can expand the clearance code to see exactly which doors fall under that specific one. Once you have verified that everything looks correct, we'll go up here and click Save. This will save the card and the badge holder data. The card is now active and should work on that reader. For more videos, please visit https://honeywelldiscoverytraining.com. Thank you.